We caught up with none other than Sir Richard Branson in New York while the new Virgin Hotel was still under construction. So, Richard. Nice to see you. Yes. Thank you for being here. Well, thank you for inviting us. So here we are uh, on, the, on the final stages of construction, finishing it off. So you're pretty excited, a hotel in New York. Uh, I'm very excited. Uh, this is the beautiful spot just around the corner from Times Square. And I think the team look like they're going to deliver a fantastic hotel. So this may be the best private event space one day in New York. On the 38th um, floor here. And if you look up there, you've got the uh, Empire State Building. You've got this uh, guy towering above yeah, us. Yeah. Good luck, mate. Thank with you that. very much. And <laughs> fantastic. Thank you for being here. Then we got to go back and explore this brand new landmark New York hotel. Teddy, first impressions are everything. And I've heard you put a lot of thought into the first impressions of this lobby. Thank you for noticing, Scott. And we did. Virgin Hotels is known as an exciting, fun brand. But what we wanted to do first is have our guests arrive in a very peaceful, embracing environment before exploring the rest of the property. Now, what are we looking at here? What is this incredible mural? We actually commissioned this piece to tell the story of Virgin and New York City. It's designed in the style of a Where's Waldo? And in our case, it's actually Where's Richard? Oh, so I'm supposed to find Richard in this <laughs> yeah, mural? Yeah, you are, you are. Oh, there he is. <laughs> So Scott, I'm really curious, what's the first thing you do when you check into a hotel room? Well, I might throw my bags down, I might charge up my phone. Me, I go straight for the view. Most of our rooms have this incredible view with the floor to ceiling, wall to wall glass. So now, what is that virgin tagline that I love? Exclusivity for all. We recognize that the industry predominantly catered to the male business traveler and we knew there was a better way. So we designed our rooms and our experience to cater to everyone. You'll see a dedicated makeup table with professional lighting. Then you have lots of closet space, enough for two, a really large sink vanity for all your toiletries and a private toilet room and a separate shower. How about this bed? This is kind of unusual. So this is our patented lounge bed. In a word, it's a playpen where you can eat, entertain, and most importantly, get a great night's sleep. Is this where Richard stays when he's here? No, he stays in his very own flat. So this is what it's like to be Richard Branson? <laughs> That's right. Every Virgin Hotel has a flat specially designed just for Richard. And we really take extra care in personalizing it just for him. You know, a great example is the gallery wall where it shows highlights of his life, his legacy, and the amazing adventures that he's been on. The intention was to create a home for Richard. And in this main entertainment space, you have incredible views of the city skyline. Yeah, I mean, imagine the party that we could throw here. Actually, you can. When Richard's not here, anyone can book this. I'm gonna put in my champagne and caviar order right now. <laughs> book it now. Now this space exemplifies what I would expect from the Virgin experience. You're right, Scott. You know, Everdeen is our all day eating, drinking, entertainment destination at Virgin Hotels in New York okay, City. Okay, so this is the hub. This is the heart of the hotel. It really, really is. And you know, as we walk through, I've noticed some incredible design details in this space, like that bookshelf and these large windows that really bring the city into the space at the same yeah. time. Now, what an incredible use of Virgin Red on this iconic staircase. Yeah, you know, red is very important to us as our signature brand color. We use it strategically for instances like this. You know, it's a real beautiful sculptural anchor at the end of the main bar down here. Now we are in our pool club, which is our resort in the middle of Manhattan. Where else can you take a dip on Broadway? Exactly, now while I have you, there's a burning question I need to know. In the history of the world, there's very few people that have reached the magnitude of Sir Richard Branson. What's it like to work for him? Richard's a visionary, but what makes him unique is that he's also very personable and approachable. And that unique combination really has created teams that are excellent at what they do, but everything that we do is in service of his grand vision. Would you call yourself a designer? I would say that I've done a lot of design um, and I love creating and 
I do sort of jump in and interfere a bit. To see the full interview with Sir Richard Branson, go to bydesign.global.